The next space we're going to play with under this area is the bomb. We're not going to touch the displace because we've already covered that one. So let's go on to the bomb. We place our bomb. Here we can see different aspects and controllers. We then take the bomb and link it to our object. Now if we play the um, the animation I've got here, you can see as the object moves and the bomb goes off, it tears the object apart. So it's a fairly useful tool for simulating explosions. And we can control certain aspects of that bomb, like the strength of the explosion. As we move it around, we can see that the explosion can be manipulated. We can change the strength of the explosion, the spin on the objects. We can put fall off on. So in this way we can simulate various forms of explosions. The fragment sizes. Um, the gravity on the bomb, the chaos factor, and of course there's the seed. I'm just going to go back and change the size of my box a bit so we can see with a little bit more accuracy what's actually happening here. So there we have it. As the bomb goes off, it blows the box to bits. And we can animate the bomb's timing, strength, and all those other factors can be animated.